It's gonna take more than just a little a little bit of spit on a rag, babe. We're gonna need rubbing alcohol, Clorox wipes, <laughs> a scrub daddy. Hey peas, what's up? This week we are finally back in our classic horror bag. I feel like it's been a while, so I'm so excited to announce that we are watching <gasps> Aliens! I actually don't know if anyone's excited about this other than me, but I'm thrilled. I've only ever heard good things about this movie. It came out in 1986. I'm super excited to get into it. Don't know anything about it other than it's a sequel. We watched the original Alien movie like almost a year ago. I have the react for the first time of me watching that on the channel as well. So go check that out first if you feel like it. I don't, I don't control you. Make sure to leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the movie down below. What do you guys should watch next? If you want to hang out some more, I stream every day except for Saturday on my Twitch stream, twitch.tv slash robbyp at 8pm Eastern Standard Time. I post videos to this channel every week. And this full reaction we have on my Patreon, where we have a private Discord as well, bitch. Um, so, I don't know if I should be cussing you out when I'm trying to get you to give me money, but yeah, we have that going on as well. Before we get into the movie, let me thank my sweet deep here patrons. I'm not cutting that out, even though people get mad at me. That's for the burpers. Thank you so much for the support, John Doe, Alexandra, Dante, Helena, Janie, Catherine, Parker, Fat Quat, Quadro, Reginald, Reina, Summer, Taltik, and ZZ. Ah, the list is getting so long. Whatever will I do with all this money I'm getting? Thank you so much for all the support for anyone doing any kind of support they give me. I'll take what I can get, honestly. Just a like is enough. Fuck. Let's get into the movie. This movie's two hours long, and I'm like, what are y'all talking about for two and a half hours? Like, huh? <laughs> oh, I get it. The first hour is gonna be the fucking credits. We're gonna introduce everyone individually, bitch. Hurry up. <laughs> Someone from my homegirl Ripley. She's still barreling through space. <laughs> Why is no one looking for her? <laughs> Ooh, why is that chair kind of fashion though? I love that. Oh, everything. Oh, is that ice? I thought that was glitter. <gasps> is it? Oh my God, they flash froze you like a fucking lean cuisine girl. <laughs> Didn't we learn from our past mistakes that we should not be opening these weird fucking caskets in this in space leave it alone if that was me on their space station i'd be like keep it past it i'm not that's not my business whatever happened in that shuttle <laughs> let let another planet in alpha centauri get that shit it has nothing to do with me cursed I know when they finally free her from this chamber, she's gonna get up and every single joint in her body is gonna pop like bubble wrap. <laughs> Maya readouts are all on the green. Looks like she's alive. Well, what about the cat? What about the cat? <laughs> How are we today? Terrible. Well, Hair looks great. Come here. How are you, you stupid cat? Damn. Well, <laughs> that cat was rude as hell to her anyway, so I guess he had it coming. I'm glad to see you feeling a little better. They, uh, they tell me that all the weakness and disorientation should pass soon. That's just natural side effects of such an unusually long hypersleep. Get out of my fucking face, blue eyes, white devil. Uh, this might be a shock to you. It's long. How hate. long? Please. 57 years. What? That's the thing. You were out there for 57 years. Probably didn't give a fuck about your family, girl. And it's really just blind luck that a deep salvage team found you when they did. This could be great news, honestly. What if you had like an annoying like ex-boyfriend who wouldn't leave you alone? This could be great, he's probably dead by now. Ooh. Uh. You okay? uh. Don't tell me that bitch has an alien inside her. Oh, God! Or she has rabies, we don't fuck with water. <laughs> She's over it. No way. No! No! I was gonna say this has to be a nightmare. No fucking way to shave an alien inside her. Disgusting little parasite freak. Sorry. <laughs> I'm never gonna over how much this cat hates her ass. Like, 
<laughs> now you freely admit to detonating the engines of and thereby destroying an M-class star freighter, a rather expensive piece of hardware. And saving the world, baby, bitch. At least that's how it's been. It. <laughs> when I told you, we sat down there on company orders to get this thing, which destroyed my crew and your expensive ship. The analysis bitch. team, which went over the lifeboat centimeter by centimeter, found no physical evidence of the creature you described. Good. Okay, don't you think that's a good thing? Why would you want to see the alien that fucking killed my entire crew and made me blow up the ship? Why would you want to come to face to face with that? Are there any species like this hostile organism on LV-426? No, it's a rock. No indigenous life. Were you there? Right. The IQs just dropped sharply while I was away. You better work. I said that it was not indigenous. It was a derelict spacecraft. It was an alien ship. It was not from there. Do you get it? And I'm the one that was going out there with the credentials, bitch. You're sitting here with your little bob in this room. God damn it! That's not all! Because if right. one of those things gets down here, then that will be all. Then all of this, this bullshit that you think is so important. <laughs> I don't know why she's worried. I wouldn't care. The ship blew up. The thing is empty. There's no eggs in the one you came in with. No one's going back to that ugly little ship planet. Whatever. Why don't you just check out LV-426? Because I don't have to. There have been people there for over 20 years, and they never complained about any hostile organism. What do you mean? What people? Terraformers. No. <laughs> How many colonists? I don't know, sixty, maybe seventy families. Do you mind? They better stay up there then. <laughs> oh, she better not be asleep. That's how grandmas die. They fall asleep with the lit cigarette. House goes up in smoke. She cut her hair off, or is it just tied up? She cut her shit off? New Year, new me. <laughs> Hi, Ripley. This is Lieutenant Gorman of the Colonial Marine Corps. Okay, and lock that shit. They've lost contact with the colony on LV-426. Oh! Who's surprised? Oh, oh, not me, that's for fucking sure. I don't believe this. You guys throw me at the wolves, and now you want me to go back out there? Absolutely yeah. not. <laughs> Can I finish? No. No. There's no way. Right. Ripley, you wouldn't be going in with the troops. I can guarantee your safety. <laughs> so these colonial marines are very tough hombres. And then they'll be fine on their own if they're so fucking tough. What do they need me for? We've been trained to deal with situations like this. Then be on your way. I would like you there as an advisor. To advise in what way? Oh yeah, that's an alien. You won't need her to tell you, bitch. You'll know. I heard you're working in the cargo docks. I think it's great that you're keeping busy. And I, I know it's the only thing that you could get. There's nothing wrong with that. Oh. What would you say if I told you I could get you reinstated as a flight officer? What if I told you I don't want to fucking go back up into space where I almost died and all, uh, no. All my fucking friends got murdered by a big old fucking Scooby-Doo villain? No. Or Spare me, Burke. I've had my psych evaluation this month. Yeah, I know. I've read it. That's a HIPAA violation. You were not allowed to read that. Just think about it. Go Coraline Jones on him and throw that cat at his face. <laughs> God, everyone in horror is always so damn wet. I know the doctors of the future are making a bank off of hyperhidrosis prescriptions. Hello. Oh, hey. You're going out there to destroy them, right? Not to study, not to bring back. That's the plan. You have my word on it. And who are you in the grand scheme of things? I don't know she stinks. <laughs> and you, you little shithead. Don't drag him with you. You're staying here. Oh, I know he was rejoicing. <laughs> he said, I can't get through this again now. <laughs> And how many of these bitches are going to make it to the end of the movie? <laughs> Let's take bets. Oh, not you, that's for sure. Girl, close that mouth. I know it is dry in there. <coughs> All right, sweethearts, what are you waiting for? Breakfast in bed? A sip of water, damn. I was sitting with my mouth open. Ow. Man, this floor is freezing. 
What do you want me to do, fetch his slippers for you? Gee, would you, sir? I'd like that. Look into my eye. These bitches are about to annoy the fuck about out of me, like, with the way they interact with Ripley. I swear to God, if anyone says a single thing to her out of line, <gasps> I need her to send them out the airlock, too. Hey, Vasquez. Have you ever been mistaken for a man? No. Have you? Right, bitch. It is too bad. Oh, why was I kind of into that just now? Like, oh, I'd want to watch. <laughs> I would have to eat in my room. I'm sorry, I can't be around y'all. This is too much. Looks like the new lieutenant's too good to eat with the rest of us, Grants. Yeah, y'all are annoying. You never said anything about an android being on board. Why not? Ripley's last trip out, the, the artificial person malfunctioned. Malfunctioned? There were problems and uh, a few deaths were involved. I know I can trust you from the jump, bitch. Was it, an older it is impossible for me to harm or by a mission of action allow to be harmed a human being. <sighs> I don't believe a second of this. Just stay away from me, Bishop. You got that straight? You have to knock over the cornbread for that. Like... I'll tell you what I know. One of our crew members was brought back on board with something attached to his face, some kind of parasite. Must have laid something inside his throat, some sort of embryo. He See, this was just like a couple of months ago to her. Look, man. Uh. Right. Somebody said alien. She thought they said illegal alien and signed up. Fuck you, man. Is this not supposed to be set in the future? How are y'all gonna be in 20, 2342 and be racist still? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Unless this is like set in 2004, then like, run around. We also have Ripley's report on disc. I suggest you study because it. Because just one of those things managed to wipe out my entire crew in less than 24 hours. And if the colonists have found that ship, then there's no telling how many of them have been exposed. You're about to walk into a fucking set up. Any questions? Yeah, why are we all so wet? How do I get out of this chicken shit outfit? You secure that shit, Hudson. They're all so fucking insufferable. I can't wait for them to start dropping. <laughs> Corp, folks, I want this loading lock sealed. Now. What do you think she's doing? One. Good. Take it away. <laughs> Whoa, they have hella weapons this time around. Thank God. I need to see one of these one of these guys in these fucking yellow suits flipping a xenomorph in the air. <laughs> Lost that bitch into space. Oh. Kinda like Megan. <laughs> Thank God they muted whatever that guy was saying. I saw his lips move and I know he was being annoying. I don't know, is there anything you can do? Save your life. Uh, but now I'm reconsidering. <laughs> Be my guest. Was he eating that cigar? What the fuck? Oh, they said we have a budget. <laughs> Where you want it? Bay 12, please. She said, I'm about it, bitch. And what? Get some. Hey. All right, people. On the ready line. Okay, yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah. yeah! I kind of like them, too. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Vasquez and whoever that other guy is. There's something about a masked man and a masked woman together that, like, is oddly comforting. <laughs> All right, I want combat seating. You know your places. Ripley said, you're right. I do know my place. On the throne. Yeah, one of those here. <laughs> Is that in this lit tank or whatever? I miss when they would make a bunch of miniatures for movies. This is so cute. Mark. Oh my god, this is just like flying in a Boeing. <laughs> No one wanted to do like a little bit of reconnaissance before we just dove right into this fucking planet. And I'm telling you, I got a bad feeling about this drop. It's a little bit late for that. All right, let's see what we can see. He has his little Burger King drive through headset on. His Xbox 360 headset. Everyone, mute the video. He's about to start saying slurs. He's on Call of Duty lobby. Where's the damn beacon? Oh, I see it. You can? <laughs> Girl. That's the atmosphere processor? Yep, that's it. That looks like some ancient alien shit. No way. 
Why would you want to populate this planet? It's fucking abysmal up here. What the hell? There's no visible activity. All right, hold it 40. Roger. Give me a slow circle of the complex. Go on the megaphone and be like, is anyone out there? Can y'all hear me? Come out, come out if you can hear me. If not, we're never going to come back up here. Show any life. Give them like at least five minutes and then fucking leave. You don't know you could. You think we're going to land? <laughs> Let's go. Move it out. Head up. Oh my God, and it's raining. <sighs> to make a bad situation worse, it's going to be all slippery. First squad up, online. Hicks, get yours in accord and watch the rear. Ripley girl, why are you here? They did not need you to just fucking watch them all get picked off one by one. They were gonna go anyway! At least you'd have a chance to live out your days in your Amazon work shop or wherever the fuck you were working before this. We're just throwing ourselves, girl. The aliens aren't gonna get you, you're gonna get yourself! Break your spine, snap your neck, throw yourself across all these metal structures. Eh. Second team, move inside. Hicks, take the upper level. Or what? <laughs> Does this not look abandoned and fucked up to anyone else? Like, I feel like we've seen enough. Uh, we got some explosive damage. It's probably seismic survey charges. You see any cats for Jonesy? Maybe he'd stop being such a bitch to me if he had a friend. <laughs> Maybe we could bring a little cat back. Oh. oh, I mean, if they're all gone, they're not gonna finish that, right? You seeing this all right? Looks melted. Somebody must have bagged one of Ripley's bad guys here. Oh, finally someone's listening. If you like that, you're gonna love this. What? Uh. Sir, uh, this place is dead. Whatever happened here, I think we missed it. Yeah, thank God for that. The area is secured. Let's go in and see what the computer can Wait tell us. It's not secure. The area is secured, Ripley. <laughs> Imagine saying that to the woman who dealt with these aliens, who just got confirmed proof that they exist. <gasps> oh, I'm gonna laugh when you die, bitch. Ripley, do not go with them. Is she is she in line? You better close Sir, that shit. They sealed you off better get back protests. in there. You better get back in that craft. Last stand. Must have been a hell of a fight. Yeah, looks that way. This is crazy that no one's freaking out. <laughs> like... <laughs> and what the fuck do y'all think this is? You know, you have a mouth and I have ears. You do not need to touch me to move me. Say excuse me, bitch. I know just you wonder. Imagine if she was like, no, actually. These ones are even bigger. <laughs> I'd, I'd say some shit just to piss them off, scare them even more. Because no one's taking this seriously, it seems to be. There are many of those little toys that have like little buttons on the side from when I was like really young. And they were just like, be a little thing in water swirling side to side. It was like Dora on one of them. I don't know what they were called. She's a lot more composed than I am, and a lot nicer than I will ever be. <laughs> a little, a little goblin girl? Are you kidding me? You did all that to a little kid? Ugh. It's all right. Come on, Robert Corporal. Don't be afraid. Come on. We won't hurt you. Shh. It's all right. She doesn't speak English. She's a cave dweller. You gotta show her some paintings or something. What? <laughs> I'm swerving off beans and peanut butter. Ugh. Oh, thank God there's a big fan, girl. <laughs> Blow some of that funk away. Easy. It's gonna be okay. It's all right. You're gonna be okay. I would not be holding on to that little stink ball that tight. Ugh. Don't get too close. You're gonna get lice. What's her name again? Rebecca. Better question. Why are we still here and not in the ship? Come on, we're wasting our time. Shut up, Sean Cody member. Get out of my fucking face. Oh, they're so 
Annoying. It's gonna take more than just a little, a little bit of spit on a rag, babe. We're gonna need rubbing alcohol, Clorox wipes, <laughs> a scrub daddy. Mom and Dad, look at me. Where are they? They're dead. All right, can I go now? Okay, she's sick of y'all. <laughs> no emotional intelligence. What do you think happened, bitch? Look around. Don't you think you'd be safer here with us? I don't blame her. <laughs> Magnificent, isn't it? Don't tell me my girl Ripley got fucking bamboozled twice by the same company. It looks like all of them. Over at the processing station. Sub-level three. Looks like a goddamn town meeting. Please blow them up. I'm not making that out too well. What is it, Hudson? Oh, my lord. What is that? If I tell you it wouldn't matter, you wouldn't fucking listen anyway. Shut up. <laughs> here we go, baby. What is the hell in here, too? All white and goofy. Watch your fire and check your targets. Why is no one freaking out? Are y'all robot people? Just all of you? <laughs> Looks like some sort of secreted resin. Yeah. But secreted from what? Nobody touched nothing. I don't know why they're pursuing this. Like, what is this gonna prove? I don't know. Is there right under the primary heat exchangers? So, she's talking about a thermonuclear explosion and adios muchachos. I say let him do it. Blow this shit up and let's get out of here. You shouldn't have said anything, Ripley. <laughs> Time open. Nothing. Zip. No, but some of them left a kettle on. I think it's ready. <laughs> Y'all hear that? What is that? Uh, oh. <laughs> Go sit up front. Petrified ass person. <laughs> oh, <goodness>. So gross. <laughs> Give it a couple hundred years. I bet in the farther, farther future, the people would be eating them like crab legs, <laughs> little xenomorph babies. Oh, no. Help! Oh! You're gonna be all right. You're gonna be all right. Okay, do you see them? Thank God. Ew, it's weird little writhing hands and nice little hot dog. Oh my God, like the whole family's about to show up. You just killed one of their babies. <laughs> Was he the one that was in that mask relationship? We hate to see it. Let's rock! <laughs> Just shooting at whatever. Who's firing? God damn it! I mean, the shit's already on fire. Why not shoot a little? Make it. Make the situation even worse. Whatever. I mean, how could it truly get worse? There's these big ass aliens all around us. Whatever. Um, talk to me, Apon! Just like we should be. Let's get the fuck out of here. Call the. <laughs> Call the plane, bitch! Hicks, whoever's left, get the Just hell out of here, damn it! I had to snatch that drive-thru headset right off his fucking head. And punch him in the throat while I'm at it, too. I got two hands for a reason. Do something! <laughs> she said bye, y'all! <laughs> All right. What the hell are you doing? Get us the fuck out of here, what do you think? She's not going in, is she? Oh my god, see if this were me, I'm leaving all you hoes, sorry. Y'all know what you signed up for. Ripley. Are you really gonna go save these hoes? Uh, <laughs> couldn't be me. 
Oh, Drake is okay. Okay, great. Yay. Oh my god! Awful day for me. Take this! <laughs> Felt deserved. This shit's gonna blow up! Oh my god. You better floor it, right! <laughs> Oh my god. This tank has gone through so much. <laughs> and we're still pushing, great to see. It's all right, we're clear. Ripley, you blow the transaxle. You're just grinding metal. Come on, he's down. You shouldn't be talking to me right now. You should be talking to that girl in the sky with the airplane to come pick us up. What happened to Gorman? I don't know. Maybe a concussion. I guess we'll have to leave him here. Oh, what a loss. The Sarge and Dietrich aren't dead, man. Their signs were real low, but they ain't dead. Then we go back in there and get them. All right, you do that, girl. Bye. <laughs> we got seven canisters of CN20. I said we roll them in there and nerve gas the whole fucking nest. I said just blow this shitty ass fucking planet up. Whatever. Cut our losses. I say we take off and nuke the entire site from orbit. Okay, Ripley, right. I'm on your side, girl. Everyone in favor, say aye. Aye. <laughs> This installation has a substantial dollar value attached to it. <sighs> they can bill me. I thought I was invited here to be the advisor and I'm advising you to blow this shit up. I'm not blind to what's going on, but I cannot authorize that kind of action. I'm sorry. I work for you, bitch. I work for, I work for the Costco warehouse. This is a multi-million dollar installation, okay? He can't make that kind of decision. He's just a grunt. Do you not see what's going on? How are we gonna? I just can't see how we're gonna recoup any of our fucking losses after this. Like, hello? Find some more 21, 22 Bitcoin or something. You'll be fine. You can make your money back. Whatever. Set him down here. And leave him there. Everyone walk away. <laughs> Hold on a second. There's something. Just get up here. Oh no. We keep losing, bitch. We just keep losing. That shit's about to swerve and crash, isn't it? Run! <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, it just keeps going, huh? Ripley, baby, I am so sorry. You were one of the very few people in this movie who did not deserve all that's happening to them right now. Oh, and somehow he didn't get hit by a bit of shrapnel. Whoa. Die! I'm sorry, Newt. You don't have to be sorry. It wasn't your fault. <laughs> She's already given up. She's like, whatever. I was planning to be here for the rest of my days anyway. And have the much hope to begin with. We got four pulse rifles with about 50 rounds each. Where did she get this cool ass leather jacket from? Has she been wearing this this whole time? <laughs> Don't touch that. Dangerous, honey. She just thought it was chapstick. I know her grimy ass hasn't seen a, a tube of Carmex in years. How long has she been here? I don't know. <laughs> Hudson, just deal with it because we need you and I'm sick of your bullshit. Do we need him? What has he contributed? We can eat him. Let him die. Hudson, just relax. Yeah, she's had it. She's like, this is not my first rodeo. I'll be in Pull it together! Check on Gorman. Continue my analysis. Fine. You do that. <laughs> if he turns out to be, like, really good and, like, he saves her... <laughs> Here, I want you to put this on. It's a locator. Then I can find you anywhere in the complex. I like him. He's cute. And he seemed to be good with kids, so... I'm sure that little girl's gonna stick around, right? Ugh. <laughs> Are there any showers on board? Like we have all this high tech shit, but <laughs> we can't get my homegirl a little bit of shampoo. Well, I bet Casey doesn't have scary dreams. Let's take a look. No, nothing bad in there. Ripley, Is... 
She doesn't have bad dreams because she's just a piece of plastic. Oh, I think she's also just a head too. I didn't realize she was just a head this entire time. <laughs> Take this for luck. Okay, thanks, whatever the fuck this is. And you see that camera right up there? As I was staring into my camera, <laughs> I was looking at something on it. Which would mean that there would have to be a lot of these parasites, right? One for each colonist, that's over a hundred at least. Those eggs are pretty big too. How the fuck is a xenomorph shitting that out? <laughs> so who's laying these eggs? Oh wow, okay. We were asking the same questions here. I want these specimens the destroyed as soon as you finish with them, is that clear? Mr. Burke gave instructions that they would be kept alive in stasis for return to the company labs. He was very specific about it. And he said, oh, he was also very specific about not fucking taking this shit back when we were talking to them. We were going to blow them the fuck up, bitch. We can both come out of his heroes and we will be set up for life. Kill him. Kill him. Do you really think you can get a dangerous organism like that past ICC quarantine? How can they impound it if they don't know about it? We'll know better, Burke. For me. Oh yeah, we're just in the house. Know that you were responsible for the deaths of 157 colonists. Wait a second. You sent them to that ship. You're wrong. I just checked the colony log. Directive dated 61279, signed Burke Carter J. And she has the receipts for you, bitch. That I didn't know. So now, if I went and made a major security situation out of it, everybody steps in, administration steps in, and there's no exclusive rights for anybody. Nobody wins. So I made a decision, and it was. Wrong. It was a bad call. And you don't think that the next decision you make right after that is gonna be wrong either? You don't have a great track record, girl. I don't know why you keep making these decisions. I thought you'd be smarter than this. I'm happy to disappoint you. Oh, she's so kind. <laughs> she's so kind. Oh, we've got to get the other dropship from the Sulaco. I mean, there must be some way of bringing it down on remote. Hell. The transmitter was on the APC. It's wasted. Well, I don't care how, but we better think of something. We better think of a way. Why can't we use the robot guy as like a remote or something? Just little buttons on him. <laughs> Bluetooth to the ship. We can come just drop it with him. <laughs> Somebody's going to have to go out there. Take a portable terminal. Go out there and patch in manual. I'll go. I mean, I'm the only one qualified to remote pilot the ship anyway. I guess that'd be fine because the aliens can't live in him anyway, right? He's not like a person to get parasited off of. It'd be fine. We're all in skyrim shape. Can't afford to let one of those bastards in here. You got a couple different bastards to deal with. <laughs> it's a little funny, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Lean into it. Mm -hmm. All right, out will kick some. All right. Counter read zero here. Uh, that's a grenade launcher. I don't think you want to mess with that. You started this. Show me everything. This is hot. <laughs> he is wearing like spray painted black football gear though. <laughs> Giving very first time cosplay. How do you feel? All right, I guess. How unfortunate. I wish you were dead. Look, Ripley, I just Forget want... it. Excuse me. She is so much nicer than me. I'd have been like, move! Because everyone here on this ship is on my side, not you two bitches. I'm going to be mean as hell. And I'm going to be applauded for it. Because y'all deserve it. It's okay. Ooh. Don't get that close to her funky head. <laughs> Stinks so bad you can taste it. <laughs> Thank God they had a plan B here. No one's a shit gonna blow up too. <laughs> uh oh. Oh my God! One of them got out. Are you fucking me off? Be quiet. We're in trouble. Stop! They set you up, girl. That was Burke's bitch ass. He took the gun, knocked that shit over, and he ran out of the room. I would serve if I was playing Clue. Oh, no! Smash it! I knew it. Girl, throw Casey at it. You've got it into auto refuel mode and the sequencing right. Oh, I 
can't wait for you to die. And I hope she kills you. Ripley, I'm scared. You should be, girl, because I'm going to sacrifice your ass. I'm not going to kill me. <laughs> I have too much going for me. You're a little cave person. I don't care. <laughs> Vasquez, meet me in med lab. We've got a fire. No, let Bert go in first. So when the door opens and that parasite jumps, it'll be on him. Oh, it'll be on her! No! Oh my god. Oh my god, there's another. Oh shit. <laughs> Come on, G.I. Joe. Oh. oh, he made sure you were obliterated this damn. <laughs> How to get your ass over here and me next, bitch. I don't know that's actually getting choked out. It was Burke. I see we grease this rat fuck son of a bitch right now. Period. Oh, and they all believed her. Yes. Thank God. He figured that he could get an alien back to quarantine. If one of us was impregnated and then frozen for the trip home, nobody would know about the embryos we were carrying. Wait a minute now, we don't know. Yes, the only way he could do it is if he sabotaged certain freezers on the way home, namely yours. Oh, she is airing him out. <gasps> oh. They cut the power. What do you mean they cut the power? Newt, stay close. Oh no. This signal's weird. Must be some interference or something. There's movement all over the place. Get back to operations. Well, what do you think that means? If you see movement all over the place, there might be movement all over the place. Just get back to where you started from and be safe, God. Get back. Work fast. Okay. I don't know why I thought that was gonna be a lot more dramatic than it was. Give me the light. Ew. You better drop that back down. <laughs> oh, ew. Come on, come on. Yeah. Oh, no, there's so many. <laughs> Evil fucking bitch. I'm so tired of him. I told you how she should have killed him. I hope he walks right into a, an alien. He's walking backwards and he bumps into one. He turns around like, oh. <laughs> oh. I don't like how acrobatic these little nasty aliens are. They're like tumbling. <laughs> This is about to be very satisfying, isn't it? <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> Get with your little mouth, right? Oh, yuck. How are all these little nasty aliens jumping over all the other dead bodies? I'm sure it'll cause a pile up. <laughs> <laughs> she said, make sure I die. Put that a little bit closer to me, girl. I'm, I'm, if I get blown up, make sure I get fucked up too. I don't want to be left here, you know, missing an arm, just like twitching. Stop. <laughs> She knows her way around the place, that'll be fine. Just tell her, just tell her where to meet. Oh no. Oh God, why did I assume there wouldn't be a water level in this movie? And there's about to be a nasty ghoul underwater, isn't there? Climb down, honey. We've got to cut through. Oh, girl, the water's cold. <laughs> Murky, uh. I mean, I guess she's been through worse, whatever. With a little dirty water to her. We're almost there. Hang in there, okay? <laughs> Hicks. I know. Hurry. I know. I mean it. 
this little girl's gonna be fine, but I still we're gonna get fucked up, we're gonna get jumped. She survived here without us, she will survive much longer on a break, it'll be fine. No, just stay still. Oh no, she will, she's about to get fucked up. <laughs> Oh no, they snatched her up. She's alive! She's alive! All right, I believe you, she's alive. Uh, We've gotta go, uh, now! Right, girl, she can be alive all she wants because we're not about to be. Oh my God. <laughs> Elevators and horror are always so damn stressful. Oh my god, <laughs> It's so fucking smoky, Jesus! Who hotboxed this fucking elevator? We're not leaving! We're not? No, girl, you're gonna go save that little girl. Not me, you, <laughs> robot. You'll be fine, we'll re-upload your conscious to another body. It'll be fine. Make it, make him taller, make him cuter. It'll be fine, it'll be great for you. Upgrade. Do you not see all this lightning arcing from everywhere? Why are we flying into this? Come on. This is gonna blow up. Oh, restock that. Okay, right. I'm taking the whole case with me. <laughs> I'm carrying it like a purse. Emergency. All personnel must evacuate. Ripley's about to serve. I mean, not like she hasn't been serving this entire movie, but she's about to slave and harder. I see it for you. I need Nancy from Nightmare on Elm Street and Ripley to uh, start a podcast. <laughs> All personnel must evacuate immediately. You now have 14 minutes to. Oh, I know that breeze feels good. <laughs> She's so sweaty. <laughs> she said, You hoes aren't sticking up on me again. Uh uh. <laughs> Okay, you're being a little extra now. There's clearly nothing in front of you. <laughs> uh, oh my god, remember at the beginning when I said I hope uh, she finds a, a friend for Jonesy? What if it's this little girl and she brings her back? Give Jonesy a friend because he doesn't fuck with you, Ripley. <laughs> <laughs> that goop stuck to her. Ugh. I think in like the year 2500, the skincare girlies will figure out like that the alien goo was really great for like Poor tightening. They'd be like, ah, oh, it's a delicacy. The xenomorph filtrate, it's great. What is all this shit just hanging from the walls though? Like, what the fuck? <gasps> oh no. Covered in snot too, just that insult injury. <gasps> oh. So wake the baby girl, be quiet. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, maybe that was the right thing to do for one. Screaming in horror, maybe that, okay, wow. She's gonna save you. Oh, wow. <laughs> Miss Ripley has had it. She's blown these bitches away. Uh. Oh, it's stuck in her hair, oh. <laughs> I was already filthy to begin with, I guess, whatever. She still had time! Oh! Girl, what the hell are we gonna do now? I guess run. These petty ass xenomorph bitches better not still be coming after us. Like, this place is blowing up. Save yourselves! Get out of here! Oh my god, we're in hell. Oh, ew. Gross. Oh my god, is this the alien queen just getting her pussy worked out? Oh my. That bitch is huge! Big Mama's house. <laughs> Oh, you better fuck her up, Ripley. She's calling all the babies in, don't- What the hell is that? Why are they so mute 
do 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 Those are the incest babies or something. They have deformities. Ah. <laughs> no worries. She said, I'm fucking you up, bitch. You can hiss and growl all you want. You're still sitting there pumping out eggs while I have the weapons. You know what? This feels like a fair trade-off. The aliens were like, oh, she's gonna fuck us up. Let her go. Uh, she's gonna kill our queen. Bye. You go ahead. <laughs> we don't fuck with you. You don't fuck with us. Goodbye. Oh, peace treaty already broken. It took all of 10 seconds. Oh, wow. They're flammable as fuck. I know this feels so good. <laughs> the stress relief from this. <laughs> that little girl is gonna be traumatized for a while. Okay, she said enough. <laughs> we get it. Girl's gonna blow up anyway. <laughs> she said, I don't care. I wanna make sure I'm the one that did it. I want them to know it was me. <laughs> All personnel must evacuate immediately. This elevator better be quick. <laughs> oh. You now have four minutes to reach minimum safe distance. You might have to take the stairs, girl. Come on! God damn it! <sighs> Throw the kid away. Whatever. Maybe her maternal instincts will kick in. She's the she's the mother too. Oh my god, ew. <laughs> Bitch, you picked the wrong one on the right day. Like, <laughs> no. Ripley, shoot the fuck out of her. Her lanky big ass. <laughs> no, she's mad. She went on one hit in. <laughs> huh? Are they, is that alien gonna take in the elevator too? <laughs> How is your big ass gonna fit in there, girl? Be for real. <gasps> they left her! And this dumbass alien still wants to get her look back, too. You know what? Fine. Bitch, let's do it. I'm tying my hair up. I'm fighting you one on one. No weapons, just hands, bitch. Like, <laughs> if I'm gonna die anyway, whatever. Oh my god. This nasty beast. Oh, bye! <laughs> Die, my bitch. <laughs> Come on. Y'all are stressing me out. Oh, he's not even bothered. <laughs> Makes it the boost. <laughs> Fuck this stinky ass planet. Hell yeah. We're out this bitch. I made it. I knew you'd come. Aw. I wouldn't have. <laughs> Shout out to Ripley for being a better person than me. <laughs> mm -mm. Something stuck to that, the foot of that. He's gonna be alright. Bishop. You did okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, the giant pussy monster! Oh god. What the hell are we gonna do? Oh, she's mad as hell. She came in mad as hell. Oh, hot breath. Big headpiece. She's kind of queening out. I don't know what to say. Please get in the big yellow mechanical thing. The suit. Got all them nasty little feet. You couldn't run fast enough to get me, bitch. <laughs> She's bombing away, but she said, "Ah, oh, not me." 
No, because why am I in it? What did I do? <laughs> you want her, not me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Woo! Get away from her, you bitch. Right, now I've cut the shit out of her. I don't know, you're in this big clunky ass suit and these aliens have shown to be like gymnastic experts. <gasps> oh, you bitch left her. <laughs> you're gonna turn her up. Oh my God, you're crunching her face. Right. Grab her neck and fucking snap that shit. Crack her like a walnut. Stop enunciating and fight me, how? Put your hands up. Oh, another airlock. This is her best trick. Ah! She's taking you with her! Hey! Oh, you crunching her ass. That's funny. Dumb bitch. You fell when I, cr I fell on top of you. Don't you feel dumb? Should have let go. What's left of him? I'm not new to this. I'm not last you, bitch. Try it. Period. Move your leg, girl. It's gonna crush that shit. Okay, thank you. Ooh. Trust me out a little bit. Gross. Bishop full of fucking Alfredo sauce. <clears throat> oh, finally someone gave her a shower. Oh, and they're gonna save Bishop, yay! Milk transfusion. <laughs> Can I dream? Yes, honey. I think we both can. <laughs> when do you hear you get a third movie? <laughs> <sighs> Please don't let something go wrong. Don't have an alien in you, bitch. Fade to black and let that be that. Oh, thank Christ. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, peas, that was fun. I feel like um, I had a good time. Yeah, there was, I don't have any complaints. It was fun. I am so glad that Ripley was right the entire time. And it feels like people were listening to her for the most part. And you don't really see that a lot in horror movies when like a female lead is just so smart. And like someone actually gives her credit for it. Like, thank God. I really liked Hicks. The little girl was cute. I mean, Ripley has nothing to do with her fucking life other than the cat. So it's great that in the next movie, I guess she's going to be a mom. And maybe Hicks is going to be in it too. I'm actually kind of interested in seeing what happens in the third movie. I know people really like this one. So I wonder how they feel about the next one. What did you guys think? Should I watch the next one? Let me know in a comment down below. What did you think about this movie? If you want to see the full reaction, it'll be up on my Patreon where we have movie nights in our Discord every Saturday. If you want to hang out some more, I stream every day except for Saturday on my Twitch stream, twitch.tv slash RobbyP, 8 p.m. Standard Time. I upload videos to this channel every week, and I will see you next week. Bye!